I have found myself alone in a, a mixing studio. Um, so here is a grand tour because I think you deserve it. And if you don't know what a mixing studio looks like, uh, which I don't, this is my first time in one, <laughs> unsupervised. Uh, and I'll, I'll show you around. This is the door. Uh, it, this is how people get in and out. It's very important because otherwise you couldn't use the room. Uh, this is a window. It's the only window in the room. Uh, and that lets in natural light. But we also have these fluorescent lights, um, which help you to see more and a fire extinguisher for safety. Uh, it's labeled very clearly, which is, is excellent. Um, this is the control, both the light switch and the air conditioner, uh, which is wonderful. Um, and you can see on the walls, we have this squishy frame stuff, which feels very fun to touch. Um, and here we have all the gear this looks like something Andrew Huang would use. Um, this is a computer. I don't really know what any of this does. Um, but, but this is the setup. We have a, a desk chair and then two other chairs. Uh, this is my stuff. Here we have a music stand. Uh, you put music on it and it holds it for you, which is quite handy because often when you're playing guitar, you don't have hands available and you need to still see your music. And um, that's what a music stand is for. And this is a microphone. Uh, this is very technical. It's wonderful. Um, it's currently listening to the foam, which is not very interesting, but I respect the microphone's decision. Uh, and this goes into this situation here. So um, that's been this tour of a recording mixing studio. I guess you could record in here. I don't know. I Yeah, I did recording on Tuesday and it is now Thursday and I'm supposed to be mixing. Um, but I might just play with the fire extinguisher instead.